Good morning, it's uh, Rick Haynes, Veterans Ford Tampa. Just wanted to show you the 2016 uh, Honda Odyssey EXL. 26,593 miles, I believe. I'll double check that. Got that uh, steel metallic exterior color with the light gray leather interior. Good looking vehicle. Really good condition. I've never seen one, to be honest with you, with this low miles. Um, <laughs> it's very unusual. Obviously, if it was at a Honda dealership, it would be a certified pre owned unit. I know Honda certifies for, I think, under, under 70,000 miles in five years, but extremely low miles on this unit. They usually come in with two, three 300,000 miles on them. So, uh, just wanted to take a look at the exterior to see if there's any scratches, unusual scratches outside of normal wear and tear. And so far, I just washed it down because it's been sitting. Obviously, there's pollen and buildup on it. So I just wanted to see if uh, we could see together if there are any significant scratches, dents, or dings. And honestly, I don't see anything on the front. I'm at the uh, driver's side front, looking at the tires, uh, excellent condition Continentals. They might even be brand new or relatively new. Now just going down the A pillar, front door, and just taking a look at the uh, overall exterior paint condition, really good condition. Making my way down to the uh, driver's side rear, again looking for deep scratches, dents or dings, and so far I don't see any, there's some light facial scratches here, super, super light, but that's normal wear and tear stuff. Wheels are in great shape. I don't see any curb rash or, or any dents or dings in the wheels. Some light scratches here on the back left rear bumper, superficial. Now at the rear cargo area, this one does have a tow package. Making my way over to the passenger side rear. Again, I don't see any any uh, unusual deep scratches, gouges in the paint. Really good condition. I'm at the now at the uh, passenger side rear, looking at the back bumper panel here. Making my way around to again, tires are in really good shape. Wheels are in excellent condition. Now at the uh, passenger side rear door. Again, I don't see anything that stands out as far as damage at all. Normal wear and tear. And I'm, I'm mistaken, we're at 26,963 miles, I believe, on this unit. There you see the right side camera. Really good shape. Again, really good condition. Oh, all, all the way around, excellent condition. We're now getting into the front. Condition of the doors and the leather. Carpets are in really good condition. It's a three-year-old vehicle, but it's in great shape. Cockpit is very clean. I don't see any any unusual wear and tear in the leather no no scrapes gouges or rips looking at the the dash it's very clean there's a little bit of scuff damage on the visor on the on the passenger side visor but that's really that's it that's all that I see here. Go back and show you that again. Again, it's looks like uh, somebody was rubbing out something that that happened, and and uh, they took off some of the uh, upholstery uh, stitching there. But it, you know, it's repairable. Very minor. Carpets are in really good shape. We're going to go to the back now. Seats are in excellent condition. Um, 
I don't know if they've even been sat in very often, but they're in really good shape. Carpets are in excellent shape. I'm gonna move the seats forward here. You can see the seats, it's a 60-40 split rear. It's a manual adjustment. And these are stowaways, so that it'll lay flat there. But, you know, again, the carpet's in very good condition. I'm going to go to the back of the vehicle. I do believe this center console, this center seat, can be removed altogether. I know that some of the newer, newer ones have that magic slide where the seats can be rearranged, but I'm pretty sure this center seat can be removed if needed be. So we're going to open up the rear hatch. Obviously, it's power door, power rear hatch. We got uh, original carpets are here. They're all sitting in the well. Let's keep them safe. You've got a, a manual uh, seating uh, controls here. Again, these lay flat. Which is pretty nice. Those will lay flat, so you can actually flip these completely down and. Then they can stow away, as you can see here. I'm sure you know all about this vehicle. You probably know more about this vehicle than I do. Overall, great shape. Uh, looking forward to having you come down and take a peek at it. Uh, at this price, I don't believe this vehicle is going to last very long. It's extremely clean. And with low miles and a popular color combination, uh, I highly recommend you trying to get down here as soon as you can. Uh, better yet, uh, maybe if, if, you're, if you're far away and, and you're not sure what time you can be here this afternoon or this weekend, maybe a good idea to put a refundable deposit on it to hold it for you. But we'll talk about that later if you're interested. Uh, again, Rick Haynes, Veterans Ford.